Hi there, today is Saturday, May 30th, and these are our two hives. The one on the left belongs to our friend, friend Marie and the keeper of this blog, being in Penfield. And this white one on the right is our hive. We are the uh, owners of the, of the property here um, where these beehives are located. So we co-beekeep with our good friend Marie. And uh, something interesting was going on. Now these hives are, are both a month old. We got our nukes at the end of, of April, installed the nukes into the hive bodies very successfully. And we've been anxiously awaiting for the, for the colony to grow and for honey production to begin and all those good things. And well, something I noticed recently was that if you look over here on Marie's hive, and I'm just gonna move over slowly, you'll see, I'm gonna zoom in. So there's a bee, bees are coming and going and coming and going. And now it just finished raining, so there's a whole bunch of debris scattered around. But um, but there is actually a steady stream of bees coming in and out. And earlier when I was observing with the binoculars, the binoculars, I was able to see all kinds of honey, or not honey, pollen collected on their on their uh, legs. And so there's a good, good pollen flow. And pollen is a sign that they're feeding their brood, which is a good thing. That's the primary thing that they feed their brood. And then what I noticed over on our hive is that we've got these cluster of bees hanging out at the entrance. And being the novice beekeeper that I am, I said, geez, you know, is there something going on with my hive that isn't with Marie's? Is, is this a sign that I have more bees? Because I know Marie, Marie was concerned that that maybe her hive didn't have enough bees, but yet it seemed like good things were going on. Well, well here's what I found out. My bees are washboarding. And I'm gonna to try to hold my camera steady. And I want you to try to look at some of the bees that are hanging out just on the white face of the hive. Pick one, any one, and you'll notice that they're kind of doing a little back and forth thing. That's called washboarding. It's kind of like busy work, if you ask me. And this is an, a mystery of beekeeping and bee biology. They actually don't know why bees do this, this washboarding thing. There's an old wives tale associated with it that says that they do it when there's not a honey flow, but that's not true. That's been disproven. And um, so it's, it's, and it tends to be younger bees as well, anywhere from 11 days old to 20 days old. Um, and then they, then they seem to get into their work routine. But, so that's what my bees are doing, is they are washboarding. And there are a number of other things that can be happening when you observe a hive from the outside and you've got bees hanging out on the outside. But if you see them just kind of going back and forth and back and forth with their little front legs and back legs and they use their mouth parts right there on the wood, it looks like they're chewing it, they are washboarding. And there's nothing wrong going on there. It's not an indication of more bees or fewer bees or honey flow. It's just a matter of bees doing their thing. And that's all for today. Thanks for watching.